Welcome Aquarius. I'm back. Happy to be here with you guys. I'm just burning the rest of my sage. How are y'all doing? I hope y'all I hope everyone is doing well. Hope everyone is doing well. Okay, yes. Now that we got that rolling. Let's talk about the remainder of July. Let's talk about the remainder of July. All right, the remainder of July. If you guys would like to follow my merchandise page via social media, it is Empress Empire Merch on Facebook. All right, if you have purchased your merch with me, guys, please leave a review. That would be greatly appreciated, guys. Um, if you would like to book your very own personal reading with the Empress, that information is in the drop box below, okay? If you're new to the channel, welcome. Click the bell to subscribe so you won't miss out. All right? Now let's talk about it. Let's talk about the remainder of July. Thank you. We got one that, that jumped. We got two. There we go, three. All right. Some of you guys are taking a pause to heal, okay? You're taking some time to heal, all right? We have numbing, okay? So it looks like you could possibly be numb to a situation. Yeah, you're trying to hide. You're trying to hide something here. Your true feelings, yeah, contemplation. You guys are in deep contemplation over a situation that you've been trying to hide. You're used to it. It's like you're so used to it that you're numb to it. Um, and some of you are trying to mask these emotions and feelings because I see you here in contemplation mode. Okay. See, let's look at the cards. You guys are in contemplation mode. Okay. So you're contemplating on something. Um, and you guys are wearing a mask trying to cover your true emotion, true feelings. Okay. But some of you definitely need to take a pause so you can heal. Okay. Take some time off to yourself so you can register everything that's going on around you um, and do the necessary work to heal, okay? So that's going to be the channel message. Let's see what we have for Tarot. Let's see. What messages are there for Aquarius? Aquarius, all right, Aquarius. There we go. Okay, we got the you got you guys' energy coming out strong. The star card coming out strong. Okay, so you're in your element. Okay, you're in your element. Okay, but it looks like you guys are having some regrets about a situation here with the five of cups. Okay, so some of you guys may be crying over spilled milk. All right, you regret possibly saying something something to that nature okay we got the ten of cups okay i'm getting like um possibly a relationship something here about the your in your your happiness okay it's like i hope you're happy but you're really crying over spilled milk maybe you're telling someone you know i wish you the best i hope i hope you're doing well but you're kind of possibly hiding that. We got the Emperor, Aries is energy. This is also the father of Tarot. So this could be father energy. This could be uncle energy, someone older, um, someone in that's in an authority uh, type of figure, okay? Show me past energy. Chariot, Cancer's energy. Okay, so you've been waiting for forward movement, for action, because we got the King of Wands here. Okay, so you've been waiting for action, okay? And then we got the Three of Cups, okay? And I'm getting there's a couple, like there could be a juggling act going on here involving three people. Eight of Wands. 
All right, so you want to speak to somebody. Got the Nine of Cups, okay? You wish you would have waited before you made a final decision. I feel like that's something that you want to tell someone that you want to speak to. You want to speak to this person. This person here is, is you know, putting this situation to rest, okay? They may be tired of waiting um, in some way, shape, or form, but they put it in this situation to rest. Like, they're, they're dead in this situation. Hopes and fears. We got the Empress, okay? So this could be, we got the mother and father card here. So this could be in regards to a, um, a baby mother, baby father situation. Someone could possibly um, find out that they are pregnant, okay? But the thing of it is, is for some of you, if someone is pregnant, you may not be sure if someone, if you guys are like on the same page as the outcome. Let's see what we got. I got the seven of wands. All right, so you're standing your ground, okay? You're staying tough and you're standing your ground. You're standing your ground. You're not ready to back down on this situation because you feel like you're doing the right thing, okay, by being stern and giving them this tough energy, um, Knight of Swords energy here as well. It's like, a, a, <laughs> this is the, the baby of the swords, okay? And then we got the father of the swords, okay? But you feel like you're doing the right thing by coming off as, as that way and having to stand your ground and defend yourself. Um, why is the Ten of Cups here? There could have been a breakup, okay? Somebody decided to break up or split. And you possibly are hoping that they can afford it or they... Um, this could be about a family unit as well, too. Why is the Ten of Pentacles here? Okay, asking for assistance, asking for help, okay? So maybe you hope that they have to come back around to you and ask you for some type of help or assistance in some way, shape, or form after there's been a split. So there's been some type of split or breakup, okay? Somebody decides to go separate ways. I have the five of cups here. I feel like, okay, we got the two of swords. I feel like... You don't want to give anything else to this person. You don't want to give anything else to this person. Okay, I feel like you want this person to regret something here. Why was the emperor here? So the wands and the emperor. Some of you, this is definitely like a baby father or a baby mama situation. Okay, someone is afraid to do things together or afraid to come together. Or someone feels trapped, like somebody's trying to trap them. Why is the chariot card here for past energy? Six of cups. Okay, because you're thinking like, okay, you're looking back at the past. Someone walked away. How they left. Um, did they leave peacefully? Okay, or did they move on peacefully? Okay. Did this person move on peacefully or did they make a big scene or did they, how did they move on? Why is the three of cups here for future energy? The tower. Ooh, the devil. I'm getting sexual energy here as well too with the devil and the ace of wands. I'm getting like, there's just like this three way thing. Like I'm getting like, why is the devil here? Ace of Cups. Yeah, like, what is this? I'm getting like there's a third party here. Could it possibly be a Capricorn or Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio uh, type energy? Okay. 
Yeah. You want, yeah, I feel like you do want to talk to this person. Um, you want to talk to this person. Small talk. I'm getting like small talk. Short talk in this person. Or maybe you have been in communication with them, but there was like a short talk, like a short talk. I'm getting younger energy. Children could be involved. Yeah, I'm getting like watch what you say. Possibly around children. I'm getting children. I'm getting like smaller, younger type energy here. You know they're watching. Watch what you say around the kids because you know they're watching. High Priestess and a Page of Swords. Definitely a spy. Like somebody's definitely watching. Okay, definitely. But I'm getting, watch what you, I'm hearing. Watch what you say around my kids. Why is the Four of Swords here? The strength card. Yeah, they're tired of of uh, some ego issues or trying to play tough. They're tired of you trying to play tough. Um, they're tired of that. <laughs> they're tired of it. Why is the Empress here? There we go again. The Empress and the High Priestess. And did this come out earlier? If this wasn't for you guys' reading, I just put this in same energy. I'm getting like a spiritual woman. Okay, like a spiritual woman, um, an older person, like a very wise woman, older possibly, like a grandmother or an aunt or someone that is a woman here. There's a mystery woman here. It could be a mis this could be a mystery person, but I'm getting like someone older, like a a wise woman. Okay, is telling telling you guys to stop arguing or stop fighting. Um, stop, you know, to like stop all the drama. We got the seven of wands. Seven of wands and the four of wands and the king of wands. Four of wands. This could be a family uh, dispute as well. This could be um, involving a community or a group as well as um, a marriage here. Why is the four of wands here? Page of Pentacles. Okay, there could be talks about money. Money that's possibly old. We got the Hermit card here. Um, Virgo's energy. Oh, the Ten of Swords, yeah. I feel like someone feels betrayed or stabbed in the back. Okay. All right, guys, you guys let me know what's going on in the comment section below. If this message resonated with you, don't forget to hit the like button. Y'all let me know what's going on. All right, if you want to book your very own personal reading, information is in the drop box below. I'll chat with y'all later.